Hey, what's up? Hello, y'all. It's your girl, Evolving Goddess. Welcome to my channel, y'all. So if you guys are new for the first time, welcome. If you haven't rocking with me, though, you already know what it is. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. So what's up, Sag team? What's going on with your love life for the month of May? What do y'all need to hear, okay? Um, you guys know that these readings are general, of course, so please only take what resonates. Y'all don't force it if it's not your story. If you want to book a personal reading, all that information is going to be listed for you below. In addition, guys, if you're in Phoenix, come rock with your girl at that Psychic Fair, May 26th, y'all. I'll be there flipping my cards if you're not subscribed to my channel what are you waiting for go ahead and hit the sub button come rock with your girl i go live twice a week y'all so you might as well come in and join on this fun y'all okay <laughs> i'm sorry guys you deserve love though okay um you guys just rock with me on live guys i can't help it i need to talk to people so come join me okay but you deserve love you're lovable of course you are sad team everybody loves the fire sign all right, so um, this is somebody reaching for something, right? Nobody's in sight. Um, or this is somebody maybe kind of not feeling like they deserve something. All right, you guys, it's safe for you to love again, right? There could have been something in the past that kind of has you a little bit traumatized, but we got true love and trust the process. All right, let's get right to it. All right, Spirit. What do we have for our SAS team? What do they need to know about their love life for the month of May? I'm excited, y'all. Let's see. I hope it's good. Let it be real. Let it be great, but let it be real. Thank you, Spirit. What else? What else face that? What do we have for our sad team? What do they need to hear right now, please? Pray. Thank you. What else? <laughs> Y'all might need to bring some laughter or some playfulness into something, guys, because I cannot stop laughing. So you guys free yourself. Free yourself, okay? Free yourself from the past. Free yourself from restrictions, all right? Yeah, free yourself from the ex, okay? Release some old energy. Release the ex energy, right? Maybe you guys are doing it, right? Um, you deserve love, but maybe you guys need to do it. This is the energy you need to embrace. Maybe you're embracing or um, you're kind of going through it right now or about to go through it, all right? But, you guys, release the past, right? The new moon is here. Go ahead and set those intentions. Guys, all it takes is intention. Just literally letting go of it, okay? Release somebody from your past. Free yourself from your comfort zone. Step into the unknown, guys, right? Let your guard down. All right, beautiful, guys. All right, so we got some new love. A new person has steered your romantic feelings. Guys, you might be meeting somebody through your friends or some of you guys need to kind of really focus on self-love possibly, right? And maybe kind of reach out for support right now at this time. All right, this could be counseling to bring a new love into a relationship. All right, this could be counseling for self. This could be a spiritual connection. Um, this could be somebody who's going to be like-minded, right? Church is important. Spirituality is important. It's somebody who's going to match your hustle, match your fly, guys. So open up that heart chakra, flirt, right? Be innocent, guys. Go out for a walk. Be vulnerable. Be naked. Okay, guys, show each other some love, right? This is a lighter energy. All right, Sash T, what do we got here? All right, beautiful. So some of you guys are moving on, right? Completing cycles. You've learned a lot. You know who you are. You know what you want, okay? You guys are maybe kind of moving, possibly. Closing out a chapter, guys. Yeah, closing out a chapter. All right, beautiful. <laughs> you guys, okay, so real quick, with this new love card, okay? Because I was just drawn to it. Um, a couple a couple signs have been getting it, but I, I didn't say it like this, guys. Look at this. This is commitment. This is marriage. So that's what I was just about to talk about. So he is proposing right he is proposing all right he is proposing and then we have here this could talk about you know um spirituality it could talk about marriage it could talk about commitment right a higher level of something okay so you guys um see the bigger picture about something guys this is beautiful you guys are starting all kind of new journeys so either you guys have leveled up in your life maybe in your spirituality and you are ascending right you're going to the next level of you're just going to, you're taking things to a new level in your own life okay you're starting a new journey like you're healing from something all right you see something clearly all right and you guys are just elevating all right others of you guys though you guys are starting something new you guys are maybe getting married getting um getting engaged taking things to a whole nother level guys so this full card he got the the higher font right behind him so you know who has his back that means you can trust the process here you don't have to carry that past baggage all right keep um take the leap of faith guys i'm really excited for you guys i can't even talk all right, some of you guys could be moving, but you guys know that you deserve love, okay? Because this lady right here, she has like, you know, an old dress. It's kind of worn down. Like nobody would have thought that she was the one to get um, a proposal, and she is, right? Because even if she can't see her value, somebody sees there's nobody like her. All right, guys, so free yourself from thinking of any type of limited thoughts or anything like that. I don't even know if I cut the deck. Did I? Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to cut the deck again, guys. But this is marriage, right? With these two here, this is marriage. All right, this is making smart decisions. This is your karma, y'all. You done paid a debt, and now you're going to get everything that you want. All right. 
here it is guys so be vulnerable right invite that li that lighter energy into your life um you guys got new beginnings your happiness is here right drop the wall here okay bring that passion that excitement back into your life okay guys absolutely this is your happiness guys this is it all right you've you've been through a lot You've been through the lot and you are standing firm in who you are. You deserve everything that you've been through, okay? This is you kind of pulling from a different um, a different strength, guys. You have overcome a lot. And because of that, you know your worth. You know your value. You're moving to victory, guys. You're getting everything that you want. Um, if you guys are having problems kind of getting to that stage, this is you. To, this is message that's here to say, hey, stay strong. Know your worth, right? Know your value. Be strong, be courageous, and go ahead and keep moving. Think about your happiness, okay? Beautiful. Be confident here, right? The chariot talks about confidence, all right? Um, this is either two people working together, or this is something coming in that's going to be victory, or this is you moving to victory, right? You could be kind of just doing your own thing, being single, all right? But this is all about bringing that inner self to the forefront, right? I know I deserve love. I've overcome a lot. I know my worth here, okay? All right, guys. So let's see. So trust the process here. All right, trust the process. You guys are being divinely guided. You may not be able to see everything, right? This could be some secrets, right? Secrets, right? We saw a proposal. So some of you guys could be like secretly proposing to somebody possibly. Um, or this could be you guys. Just, we'll see why she's here. I don't know why she's here. This, the high priestess, this is definitely just trusting the process, right? You can't see everything in front of you, right? You can't see it, but you just got to trust it, right? You got to follow what makes you happy. That's what you got to do, okay? <laughs> These cards keep on to come out. All right, yes, guys. This is some secret proposal, y'all. I hope no cross watchers are watching this, guys, because somebody is proposing, okay? So, you guys, you found your happiness, right? You're making that proposal. You're making that love offer. You're keeping it a secret, right? You know your value. You know what you want. You see somebody like this, and you're moving forward, right? You're leaving the past baggage behind. Um, others of you guys, right, you could just be kind of stepping into your own, right? Stepping into your own thing, right? Elevating, right? You are filling up your own cup. You love yourself. You're finding that peace and that harmony, that balance in your life. Um, this could just be a new love offer coming in for you, right? We got new love, so this could just be new love coming in. Right, maybe you didn't see it coming and it just snuck up on you, right? Because the high priestess talks about hidden truths, okay? It's like while while you were in the process of kind of releasing everything from the past, it's like something snuck up on you, all right? So enjoy it, all right? Enjoy this bliss. Enjoy this happiness, okay, guys? You didn't see it coming, right? You didn't see it coming. So this is, you guys didn't see it coming, right? Um, so really quick, guys, please. Um. Don't be scared, right? Know that you deserve love, right? Don't be scared. Don't be guarded, right? Don't be stuck. Don't be confused, all right? Get an understanding of what it is that you want. See things clearly for what they are. Remove the blindfold, right? Follow your intuition. You can trust your intuition. It's only going to lead you to your happiness. It's for your highest good always, all right? So some of you guys could be feeling a little bit stuck in something, right? So some of you guys could be feeling a little bit stuck in something, right? Not really sure how to proceed. So this king of, this king of cups is somebody who really knows how to express his love he knows what he wants he's a great provider he's a great father he shows love all right but if he's a little bit confused he might be a little bit emotionally all over the place okay so he made his appearance for something so you guys be confident and act on the things that you want guys go ahead and act on it all right others of you guys don't be stuck and blinded by something that you know you guys got to free yourself from okay you guys got to listen to your intuition you guys got to focus on self-love here know that you deserve love and you got to leave something behind you guys got to see the truth of the matter and something there could be some secrets or something okay you guys listen to your intuition and take that blindfold off okay guys beautiful all right so yeah so you guys see somebody as the star right this is the wish come true all right this is you guys being real and authentic all right this is you guys moving forward with something okay um possibly fire and water or this is just bringing that balance right this is also faith guys right the star card this is faith with the high priestess this is continue to keep the faith everything that you know that you want you will have it you're being divinely guided right to your happiness guys you can trust it all right so continue to be real continue to be vulnerable that wish that you want is already here on the board for you guys you deserve everything that you want this could be financial for you but i don't know why i said that but it could be financial for you but others of you guys right it's like as you become naked and as you become vulnerable and as you express yourself you you're going to get it. It's right here on the board for you, okay? Um, others of you guys could be healing from something where there were some secrets that came out. So you guys are kind of just focusing on your love right now or there is a need to focus on self-love and really go towards your happiness. Listen to your intuition on something.
something, right? It might mean that you have to be single or independent, but don't be scared, right? Embrace this opportunity here, okay? Don't be guarded, all right? See things for what they really are, okay? All right, so somebody's planning, right? With the Ace of Cups, this is the planning. This is making a decision. This is moving forward. This is looking at that wish, right? I'm making the decision to move forward towards something that means a lot to me. You wish upon a star, right? When you make a wish, that's that one thing that you want. So he's making a decision to move forward towards his happiness here. He's envisioning his future with somebody. All right, this is two people kind of working together, two people bringing love into the relationship or just two people, um, you know, planning their future together, right? That's what they're looking at. There are two people working together. Others of you guys, you know, you guys got to really kind of analyze what your future looks like. Once again, you got to have faith here. Faith is really strong in this message, guys. You guys got to have faith and you got to take a leap of faith on the things that you want. You got to trust the process and you got to know you're being divinely guided and it's leading you to emotional fulfillment. All right, guys, you guys got to know that. Anything else? Yeah, making the decision to self-love, making the decision to move forward with that love offer. Being out there, they're going after what feels good to you, okay? All right, guys, yes, you guys, somebody is getting married and getting engaged. Somebody, this is a celebration, right? This is celebration, guys. This is happiness, right? Somebody didn't see it coming, and they're getting surprised. eyes. All right, guys, so this is a level up. Right, this is definitely a level up here. Um, this is you guys also for some of for my people that are kind of separating from somebody. This is you guys turning your back, right? Turning your back on the confusion, focusing on self love, having faith, trusting the process here, focusing on your happiness, um, not not um, focusing on anything where there could have been like a lack of support, right? Lack of commitment, possibly third party situations, right? Turning your back on that, making the decision to look forward, being optimistic about your future here, freeing yourself from what feels comfortable. All right, others of you guys, you may be feeling a little bit stuck, so please reach out for support, right? This is friends, this is family, this could be counseling, whatever the case is, but this is you getting that mental clarity, right? Mind, body, and soul, making sure that you have that mental clarity so you can make a decision on something, right? Some of you guys could be reuniting, possibly. This could be a re this could be somebody reuniting and you guys kind of taking things to a whole nother level, possibly. Um, but this is all about making a decision about what that future looks like for you, okay? But some of you guys definitely need to reach out for support here, okay? All right? So be confident, guys. Follow your bliss always. All right, your happiness is here. Be real and authentic to who you are. What makes you feel good? What makes you feel good? What do you guys want? That wish of yours you want to come true, it is right here on the board. All right, guys? Free yourself from anybody or any situations that has you feeling stuck. All right, guys? Who has you feeling stuck? All right, if you don't have that peace of mind, guys, let it go. Let it go. All right, guys. So um, be optimistic. Let that wall down. All right, Sag team, this is beautiful. All right. <laughs> All right, this is it, guys. I love you guys. Thank you so much for your support. And as always, y'all, talk to your girl. I'll talk back, y'all. Peace.